Hey guys and welcome to another video. Today we are going to be working on my BMW E60 and we are going to try and figure out how we can get it louder because in my previous episode I tried to remove the rear muffler. If you have not watched that episode go and watch it, it's a good one. But for those of you that did watch that episode you know that we did not get this car that much louder. I mean, I did remove the rear muffler and I welded it in on my own. That's actually the downpipe on my Skyline. And this is how it looks underneath right now. It's not loud enough. But I have been reading your guys' comments and I think I should now remove the DPF, the diesel particle filter or whatever it's called. Some of you guys suggested the downpipe, but that's expensive. So we'll do the cheapest part first. Today we will take off the DPF and just gutting it all out. Uh, hopefully we'll get some more sound. So now let's jack up the car and take a look under there. And by the end of this episode, let's hope that we can get this car louder. And we are fighting with the clock today as well as usual because it's after work and it's getting darker by the minute. And uh, I think I have like one and a half hours. So let's hope I can bang this out in one and a half hours. <laughs> let's start the clock. So here we got the DPF. A lot of people think that the DPF is in the downpipe and on some cars that's correct but on the E60 model this is the DPF. What I see right here is that I can remove it right there and I can remove it right there. You only see there's some nuts and bolts right there. I think I'm just going to take these eight bolts, try to remove them and take this thing out and then start to yeah get it out. And hopefully this will go very pretty fast. Uh, I need to get a girl better garage. This ain't cutting it. under the car exhausting stuff but I think maybe we used 30 minutes 40 minutes now and now I will show you that this is the diesel particle filter check this out what's inside a diesel particle filter you will see that that does not create good airflow see this this is the inside so now we're going to try and get that out I've used I got a drill and some stuff so we'll hopefully use that to get it out just for the fun of it how much does this weigh now and then we will weigh it after i've removed everything okay so we got 7.2 a little disclaimer here the content of the dpf is quite dangerous to breathe in do not do that so wear a mask if you're going to do this and like dispose of it like in the correct way and stuff like that so i'm going to use a mask right now gloves and yeah you do not want that on your hands, not in your mouth, not in your nose, not anything. But uh, yeah, let's get some more sound in this car. I'm ready. <laughs> done and it took about 30 minutes 40 maybe I mean this is a lot of stuff and now this is completely empty now you can see nothing nothing left it was 7.2 
Okay, uh, this scale does not work below 5 kilograms, so uh, I don't know, but it's below 5. So that means we lost at least 2.2 kilos. That's good. Weight reduction, bruh! Since the car is such as at an angle, I do not want to start the car right now because the oil is, yeah, not like in that part of the engine. It's all down there, so it's not a good idea to start the car. At least I think so, so I will not do it. Okay, now I think I'm done under the car. I just actually also removed this piece right there, which is under the car, there to there, over underneath the exhaust. Does this stiffen up the chassis or something? I don't know. Tell me in the comments if this is super important and I will mount it again. Uh, but if I don't feel any difference while driving, I think I will just keep it off because the exhaust is rattling a lot into there. Someone has tried to fix it before with something, I think. I don't think this is OEM. Let's get the car on the ground and fire it up for the first time and hopefully this was worth it. <laughs> Okay, now I will let the car warm up for a little bit and while I clean the driveway, then we will hear how loud it is. consequences of removing this because there is something already but i will leave that for the next video but anyways thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed and i will see you guys in the next video goodbye <laughs>